the world is suffering and this suffering is endless. As long as the Ravan within us is still alive. To end this demon, we need to awaken the Ram within us. Diwali is this festival of lights. It is a celebration of victory of good over evil. Today, as we celebrate Diwali, let's try to evoke the Ram within us by recollecting all the courageous acts that made him the Mariyata Purushottam, the Supreme Man. In ancient India, during the Treta Yuga, a famous king called Dashar reigned over Bharatvarsh. He lived with his three beautiful wives, namely Kaushalya, Sumitra, and Tekel. And his four sons, Ram, Bharat, Lakshman, and Shatrugan. As the time passed, the four princes grew to become fair and courageous gentlemen and got married to beautiful princesses, namely Sita, Mandabi, Urmila, I and happily announce Ram to be my heir and the next king to my throne. My dear king, I need to remind you your promise which you made when I saved your life. I request you to send Rama to exile and make my son Bharat the king of this country. But how can I take Kai? But your promise. My dear father, I can give my life to fulfill your promise. I am willing to go to exile and you can make my brother as the new king. I can't leave my brother to suffer alone. Bhaiya, I will come along with you. <laughs> Vibhishan, Rama's gentle brother, also asked Raman to return 
Sita back to Ram and asked for his forgiveness, but haughty Rama dismissed his proposals and threw him out of his kingdom. Ashamed and sad, Vibhishan went to the woods to meet Ram and asked him to be his savior. Ram decided to kill Ravan and reach Lanka to bring Sita back. To reach Lanka, he prepared a bridge with the help of Hanuman's monkey army. Ram and Ravan declared a war. It was a Ravan, the ill has to end and that is its fate. I am killing you to restore peace and prosperity of the world. <laughs> now, after the completion of 14 years of exile, Ram, Sita and Lakshman went to their city, Ayodhya, and found everyone waiting for them. The whole city was decorated with flowers and lamps and there were happiness everywhere. And from then on, on this day, we celebrate Diwali by decorating our cities, streets and houses with flowers and lamps to rejoice the victory from the good over evil. Thank you.